Yo, what's up guys, Robert here, and today you guys are going to be doing Madden 17 Team Challenges. So today we're going to try to do Dolphins, Cowboys, and Patriots. So I think Patriots is going to be the hardest one here. Hopefully we can get it done. Let's hop into this Dolphins and hopefully we can get ourselves a win. Alright, we legit need to get back to posting this like every day because I've been slacking off so dang much in this series i mean I, I don't i don't i don't know why but i've just been slacking so much on it all right here we go play action seems let's see what we can do here i have ozzy newsom on the team so i didn't really do a head-to-head -head gameplay with him i just kind of added him on the team because he's probably the best one we could get but bang bang that's like a 50 yard game not 50 yard game i'm sorry that's the dumbest thing i probably said all right, here we go, first and ten. But, dude, I want them to release a Michael Vick so dang badly. I mean, we just got a quarterback, Zach Prescott, but, like, I want Michael Vick so badly. All right, second and four. I mean, I, I feel like Zach Prescott not paying attention to, um, oh, Okay. Uh, anyways, as I was saying, I feel like Dak Prescott not paying attention to old like stats and stuff like that is definitely probably the best quarterback in the game. And the reason for that is I'm going for it, dude. And the reason for that is because like his throw on the run is probably the best in the game for a running. Well, he's not really like a run first quarterback, but just paying attention. Oh. Sterling Sharp and maybe catch their touchdown. Let's freaking go, baby. Literally against the AI, I don't know about head to head, but like if you want to go for a two point conversion, line up in the Wildcat and just hand it off to your person that's running across every single time. I have not had this stopped by the AI one time yet, and I've had have done it a lot of times. Alright, so I literally cannot finish what I was trying to say. So I think Dak Prescott's the best quarterback in the game. Because his stats, like Brett Favre is definitely either the best quarterback in the game or the second best quarterback in the game. And I'm just going to keep talking because I literally just can't talk in one single time before I cut out. I think he's the best, or Brett Favre is definitely the second best because he's a like sitting in the pocket kind of passer. He's not the one where you can escape with the pocket and get a lot of yards. That's why Dak, you can do that with Dak Prescott, who's the best running quarterback in the game and maybe even the best quarterback in the game. And the fact that he has throw, good throw on the run and good speed, that you can literally throw dimes while throwing on the run. I haven't had any bad throws with him while throwing on the run, so that's 100% a positive. So that's my honest opinion of why he's the best quarterback in the game. I mean, he's good, but if the Cowboys don't go to the playoff or to the Super Bowl this year, oh my, Peters! If the Cowboys don't go to the playoffs this year, I feel I bet he's gonna be a flunk next year. Watch it happen. I'm glad I got all that stuff out. When I intend to talk about things, I just keep talking. I don't, I don't understand that. But here we go. We're gonna throw it to Deion Sanders over the middle. That's a dime, baby. Well, actually, no, I don't want to do no. All right, I forgot to put shoot clock on. So if we get a touchdown here, I apologize. Well, actually, never mind. If I get a touchdown here, I'll just go. Oh, we're getting a touchdown, baby. We're getting a touchdown. That's what I'm talking about. I'm gonna make it 16 to nothing. I'll see you guys in the third quarter. Well, actually, I won't see you guys in the third quarter yet. I gotta show you guys this two-point conversion because it's gonna work again. Ready? You know, you know, you think the AI would be like, hey, they're gonna go right back to that same play, but no. AI is stupid. I'll see you guys in the third quarter. I don't know how you guys think about this, but I might, sometimes I might upload this series twice a day. Because if I don't, the series will be going on all season. Unless that's what you guys that was close. I guess that's what you guys want, is me to post this series all season long. Alright, second and ten, baby. Here we go. I've been blitzing them, like, every single play, and I'm telling you right now, Ryan Tannehill has been horrible with it and throwing bad dimes. I shouldn't call them dimes, actually. Alright, third and six. One more time. I don't want this Dolphin team scoring any touch or any points on the board. I don't care. 
what they want to score. I'm not letting them score anything as we're going to sack Ryan Sandhill. Our ball, let's run this clock out. All right, as you guys know, we're going to be running the ball 24-7 just to run this clock out. I want to try some read options with Dak Prescott here. We didn't do that in the gameplay yesterday, mostly because mostly I was just frustrated and stuff like that. But I will see you guys in the fourth quarter. Also, I have a, like, like our game like our gameplay coming out so I kind of didn't time it to be to come out on New Year's I mean it's kind of lucky it came out on New Year's because now you guys have something to do if you're not having like a party at your house to stay up so I guess I kind of timed that right I don't know but I hope you guys do have an amazing New Year's I know I'm going to I have a great New Year's every year but Obviously, this might be the year that I have a horrible one, but uh, I'll see you guys after the two-minute warning. All right, all we got to do is run the clock out. There are two time or three time timeouts left. Jeez, what am I talking about? So we got to get seven yards here. It's first down. And, oh, wow, with Damian Tomlinson. There's, I don't know why they call timeouts. Like, EA just has to make this stupid system where the AI thinks they're going to come back and they're not going to like i think what they should have done is like if i got a first time first down after their first timeout they should just stop calling timeouts i don't think they should just call a timeout every single time because coaches in the nfl do not call a timeout every single time if they get a first down that's like okay game over they're gonna kneel it or whatever so I don't see why they have to call a timeout. But there we go. I'm going to kneel it, and I will see you guys against the Cowboys. So Dak Prescott is playing against Dak Prescott. All right. With all these players we're getting, I'm thinking about doing a head-to-head -head season game with all of the players that we get and doing a gameplay and see if we can get ourselves a win. It's going to be hard. All right, I ain't gonna lie to you guys. I just did this game and I'm playing it for a second time now. I just lost to this team because somehow he was just throwing dimes against my defense no matter what I threw at him. So hopefully we can change that. That means we're probably going to be playing two games in this episode. I, I definitely gotta start playing this like or posting this like once a day because if we don't we don't finish this, it's gonna be or if we don't do enough games, it's it's gonna be a while. Come on, man, we gotta stop him. I don't feel good about doing this game twice. We should have we should have won last last time it's just stupid we have to play this game twice now i feel like I've, i'm not blitzing them dude because i feel like if i blitz them they're just gonna screw me over that's what was happening last time i was blitzing them and somehow this team was throwing dimes all over me i don't understand it there we go in the sack deck press guy cover two spy they need to throw at midfield and i bet they're doing four verticals they're not doing four verticals i am surprised i am surprised Get him down. Thank you. Like I can't believe we lost last game. Like the score was eight to ten. So it's not like it was a high scoring game whatsoever. I just I can't believe I lost to this team that's like a seventy something overall. It honestly makes me want to cry. Alright, we're doing the screen with Ladanian Samuelson. Hopefully we can get some yards with this and they don't read it. Thank you for not reading it. Get that block. Thank you. Okay, alright, alright, okay, don't fumble now. Play action read. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. There we go. Go Antonio Brown gets the touchdown. Bang bang. One touchdown. Let's go for two. Let's freaking go, dude. Two point diversion time. Dude, I'm. Oh my god. I forgot to hand it off to him, but at least we got in the end zone for two points. Alright, they need to get downfield and get a touchdown and watch them do it. We get the ball at second half, luckily, so we can just run the clock out after that. That's why I like getting the ball at second half, so we can just run the clock out. But we're going to stuff that run 100%. Watch Dak Prescott throw dimes all over my team somehow. Watch it happen. Guaranteed, it's going to happen. Like that that's all that was happening last game and that's the main reason why I lost because somehow he was just throwing dimes all over my defense. Hopefully we can just get a stop here. I really honestly want to. 
I don't want them getting any points this game. You're gonna do four verticals here. Throw it at me. No, you won't. you're not. You're gonna dump it off, and you're not gonna get anywhere. All right. So definitely tomorrow I'm gonna to be having another episode of this, and we'll be probably posting. Or we will probably be playing three games. So hopefully we can do a lot better than just two games today. I did not want to lose that last game. Alright, so let's just run this clock out, baby. That's what we got to do here. Four, three, two, one. Bang, bang. Here we go. Ladania Tomlinson getting about a five-yard or four-yard game. Here we go. I'm going to do pass here on second and six. See if we can move the chains. I'm going to dump it off to Deion Sanders. First down, move the chains. Going to do another inside zone here. Here we go. Go, Ladania. Okay. The, oh, oh, oh. Here we go, two yard game, making something out of nothing. Here we go, second and eight, baby. Come on, come on. Okay, okay, I'll just dump it off to to Martellus Bennett. Move the chains. All right, let's run the ball here on first down, and then we'll be heading into the two minute warning, and hopefully we can get a first down so we don't somehow lose this game. Like it honestly feels like I've been playing these three games, I guess you can say, because I lost the other one, like, forever. I don't know why, it just feels like I've been playing them for so long now, so, I don't know. It's my first time out by Dallas. We're getting in the Wildcat, baby. Oh, I shouldn't have ran it this way. I should have ran it the other way. But here we go. We're not going to hand it off. We're just going to take it ourselves. Here we go. Lavania Tomlinson. Probably could have taken that for a touchdown. I just want to run the clock out right now. Here we go, second and eight. Come on, let's let, oh God. Okay, we're gonna get stuck there. Please let us convert here on this third down. Please let us move the chains here. Please, please don't be a douche, EA. Please don't be a douche, oh my God. Oh my God, run Dak, run Dak. Get the first down, there we go, get out of bounds, just to be safe. That's gonna be the end of the game there. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, tomorrow we'll be having three games. We'll probably be playing three games instead of just two. I just, I need to get a lot of videos done for tonight. Especially that you guys got like an hour gameplay for tomorrow, the new series coming. So I hope you guys enjoy, well actually tomorrow, it's the same day. So you guys will be having like an hour gameplay coming out in two hours. Um, so hopefully you guys will enjoy that because it's New Year's. So hope you guys have an amazing New Year's, safe New Year's, and uh, happy New Year, I guess. And I have a good resolution that I would like to have for 2017. So uh, yeah, once again, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace out, homies.